three coffees. <clears throat> Pay attention, James. Cup of coffee in the big time. Adonis Paul says, Hi, Jimmy. It's AP again. This is your daily reminder that your pathetic life consists of nothing but staring at your own reflection in the phone and trying to woo a nurse who's probably under a large black man. Same as Eliana. For a skinhead, you sure do lose a lot of women to the bucks, James. I have a woman, Royce. Uh, Royce has a woman. Mersh can at least part a coke for pussy in a pinch with his strip club connections. You are out there uh, trying to desperately make a trade of vagina for blueberries and costume jewelry. <laughs> Jesus Christ. This is AP, by the way. This is not me. But it's brilliant. Step it up now or blow them out, James. I know you couldn't live like a samurai, but you could die like a samurai, karate boy. You will be alone forever, shouting laughable insults at your superiors who will all look at you and treat you like a small dog barking at our heels. You are weak, pathetic, and have a tiny penis, and will never have the success or love that everyone you hate has. Your dad has the right idea, James. Your bloodline needs to end, and if he had any foresight, he would have taken you with him. Finish the job, Jimmy. The world has enough Clarks. Whew. Let's uh, check in on James right now. <laughs> That nigga's dead. Not great, Jimmy. By the way, not me. Those are the words of Adonis Paul. 